What's up everybody? So we are gonna go for a little hiking trip this afternoon. This is a better shot of the road where I'm going. Oh shit. I'm going up there today, folks. When I said that you need a tribal permit, this is exactly what I'm talking about right here. Tribal conservation permit required for all recreation. Motorized vehicle travel prohibited off established roadways. So I made it out here into the sticks. And um, I started from the bottom because a lot of people will drive up, but the road's really bad, honestly, it's kind of washed out. I mean, it's straight downhill, you're driving up a mountain. So when all that snow melts in the spring or summertime, all that water runs straight down those trails or paths or roadways and uh, really messes up the whole road. So I'm just gonna start from the bottom, go all the way up, be a little bit easier. It looks like they uh, got new, something new. So, I'm on a bridge now, we're at the canal. So this is, this is the canal here. And, uh, yeah, there's, there's multiple ways to get up. Like, as you can see here, it has trailhead to the left, but you have to cross a creek in order to do that, which I don't like because people drive their big ass trucks down that way and <laughs> drive right over the water, right over the river, right over the stream. And when you can just go up this way, this way works too. You can drive up this way and it all meets and splits at the same spot. So whatever. We're going to hike. So I'll get back to you. This is a uh, prime example of what I was talking about, how water, once it runs down, it just kind of washes this road out really bad. Gone up a little bit. As I am getting higher and higher, I can feel it getting colder and colder. We've come to the fork in the road. <clears throat> Moment pass to the right. Terrace and Swartz are uh, to the left, my way. So, looks like there's some tracks here. Look fairly fresh. So, hopefully, it's just me up here, but it doesn't look like it. Looks to me as if they fix a bridge too, because it was gnarly before. You couldn't barely like drive over it; like the wood was just falling apart. So this is it. This is the uh, the parking for the trailhead. Hopefully, it's just me. Something moving out of there. Must have heard me moving. Cause that chipmunk's freaking the fuck out. 
And it is just me up here. Sweet. Looks like there was somebody earlier. There's like tracks. Somebody definitely pulled in here earlier. So we made it, and what I was talking about earlier is a lot of times people make it to a location, they take their pictures, and they leave, which is fine. You can totally do that, but take some time to just enjoy it. Don't say anything. That's how you're supposed to feel. And if you ask me, that right there looks kind of like sunset. Talk about beautiful. Told you the sun was going down. Wow. So we made it back to the truck, back to the vehicle, and uh, it was a good hike. Nose is running. That's how you know uh, you're out here, literally. And uh, I don't want to. I don't want to wipe it away with these new gloves. So, anyway, back to what I was saying. We made it. We did it. It was a great hike. We had a great time by ourselves, and essentially, that's what we want to do. We want to learn to enjoy things on your own. Now, it's always great to have somebody with you. It really is. A hiking partner is great. But for those people who don't necessarily have a partner or want to go with somebody or just need a spiritual release, for me, I do it alone to get the spiritual release. This right here, oh my, I'm glowing. I love this. You got, you got to go do something like this. You got to go, go up in the mountains, go breathe the air, go look at the lake, and enjoy life. And I think that's what we need to get back to as a society. We need to just enjoy shit more. That's what we need to do as a society is to just enjoy. And that's what we need to do as a society is to enjoy life a lot more and just appreciate all the little things that we have in this life and and love it. Again, today's sponsor, Eddie Bauer, uh, First Ascent clothing and products. You can find them on eddiebauer.com. Just kidding, I wish. I do have a lot of Eddie Bauer stuff. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more. I'm gonna have a lot more videos hiking. The drone's coming. We're going to do drone videos. That's what we got this for. And today was just kind of like the first vlog ever. So, 
stay tuned. We're going to do a lot more photography, a lot more camera stuff, a lot more wood stuff, and, and we're going to talk about tourism and the land and everything else. So, so stay tuned. A lot of good information, a lot of good stuff to uh, help you maybe live a happier life, naturally. So thanks for watching.